All right, Bobcat fans, we're here, Student of the Week segment. This segment is sponsored by Roofmasters and Bubba 33 in Longview, Texas. Today, our guest is Miss Lamaya Henderson, a junior here in Hallsville High School. Lamaya, how are you today? Good, I'm doing good. Now, we're here for basketball. We got to see a basketball game last night, and I'm going to just get right into it. It's How long have we been playing basketball, Lamaya? I've been playing ever since middle school. What what about basketball do you love? I love the sport and how it gives me some type of spark to just be there. Yeah. And one of the things you noticed, at least we did watching last night, is the speed that you bring to the game. Do you like playing defense as much as you do offense? Yes, sir. I do. And is it? And we're going to go into the track side here in a little bit. But when you're coming down and you just steal it from, I, I, there was a play last night where a young lady had the basketball. And she was about oh 20 foot in front of you, and you took two steps and were in front of her, way in between. Come his, flying. And <laughs> come flying. Do you enjoy looking at people's faces when you run up behind them like that or in front of them? Is it is it enjoyable just sucking you know somebody down like that? Yes, sir. Anything. To for my teammates, I have to I have to go chase them down. So, what is your favorite part? What is your favorite thing to do in a basketball game? Steal the ball or go in and dunk? I would have to say steal the ball. And just the surprise on their face last <laughs> night. Last night we was thoroughly impressed with how fast you was out running everybody in the court, and your presence on the court was was. And you're pretty damn intense. How many fouls did you end up with last night? One. It was a good one. Now, and before we get into talking about, you know, the, the school and the track and field, one of the things we've noticed in calling girls game is fouls don't get called. It's a rough game on the court. I mean, is it just the officials don't call this blood drawn? What about a girls basketball game? It's rough out there. Am I wrong? Yes, it, it is. It is. I mean, hair pulling, bumping, <laughs> throwing, yes. Now, because uh, we talk about all this speed, so – I go back in the school. What what are what are our grades like, Lamar? Are we doing all right in class? Yes, sir. I'm doing all right. I'm doing She's all right. top ten in her class. Top ten percent. Top ten percent. Do you have yeah. to put a lot of work and effort into the studying, or is that something that comes naturally to you? I would say I would say both, because you know it does come natural. But at the end of the day, you still have to keep it up. Yeah. What, what is your favorite subject? English. English, there we go. Neither one of us is real good in English. Yeah. You're safe. Right we, we have no questions to follow up. I don't even know what an adverb is. So we're, you're good there. And so what do you want to do after you graduate here in Hustle? I would love to go to Arkansas University. Fayetteville. So what do you want to do in Arkansas? Hall. I just want to run track. And run track. So we've heard that you're pretty fast, okay? We saw it in the game last night. So what what are your track events that you participate in? All of them, or is there certain ones you're better at than another? Uh, my main are the 100 and the 200. So what are your times in the 100? My fastest time was a 11.72. Yeah. And the 200 was a 24.4. So my partner run time ran a twenty four second twenty yard dash. It was pretty impressive, isn't it? I was rolling. <laughs> it was I rolling. was rolling, and the truck was moving fast. Now, how's that compared to some of the other athletes around East Texas? I would say the mindset. Yeah. Hey, hey, have you lost an event in a while? I have in summer track. Yeah. Does it does losing an event like that does it does it eat at you and make you want to work a little bit harder? It does. Yeah. So I got in track it's a it's a it's a it's a one person show. In basketball you have a team. What is more difficult uh, relying on four other people or just all by yourself out there? More difficult. Mm. I would have to say they both come at a certain extent. Right. Because when I'm by myself, it's just hey, it's just all about you. But when I'm with the team, I feel like the bond comes with it. Right, right, right. So you have other people, you have other energy, you have other people that spark you with their energy. And just to come as a group and to show out together is the biggest thing that... So if you're running track and, and you don't win, it's 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 you. But yeah. if you go in and miss a layup or, or foul or Coach Long gets mad at you, it's a group of folks. So I can understand that would be the difference. It feel like you're letting a lot of people down. Yeah, and you don't do a lot of that. Mm -mm. Real quick, this year in basketball, what's been your favorite moment so far? Do you have one that sticks out in your mind? Coming out of the game, anything like that? 
on bus rides? I would have to. I would have to say, and truly, everything, every moment with my team, yeah, mattered to me. You're so enjoying it this year. Enjoying it this year. That's well, awesome. Amaya, thank you for joining us. It always flies by too fast. Good luck. Everything you do, we'll be watching and calling games this year. Fans at home, we'll see y'all next time.